My name is Charlie Frankovich. I'm the Senior Director of Consumer Insights and Analytics at Here at Shake Shack. John Agumpo-Volchev, Director of Culinary and Brand Marketing. John Carandris, I'm the Executive Chef and Vice President of Culinary Innovation. I'm Jay Livingston, Chief Marketing Officer of Shake Shack. My favorite dish uh, is a double shack burger. My favorite meal is the chicken shack. The smoke shack, the black truffle burger. But lately I've been into the veggie burger and a lettuce wrap with avocado. Fantastic. So I've been at Shake Shack about five and a half years, and when I got here, we were all instinct-led. But we knew as we scaled, we needed to add a certain level of data and insights to make sure that we saw opportunities that maybe our instincts weren't finding, but also that kept us from making big mistakes. As a culinary first brand, it's really a fine dining burger in a fast casual environment demands incredible ingredients. LTOs, limited time offers, really give our guests a chance to try something new from us all the time. We were making products that felt really cool, but we weren't necessarily thinking about how do we bring this to our guests in an effective, understandable, and exciting way. We rolled out a cascara shake. It turns out not a lot of people know what cascara is. So what we created was a product that tasted awesome, that everybody loved when they tried it, but just didn't make sense to the guest. It was not very successful for us. Upwards of millions of dollars can be lost if we don't get this LTO process right. The Black Truffle Burger is one of the first times that we really introduced data into the experience of developing an LTO. Our guests kept providing us with critical information. We developed on that truffle burger and launched a white truffle burger because of our guest feedback. Our Harvest Berry Lemonade LTO was tremendously successful, driven by confirmation from marketing via our guests that it was going to be something that they wanted to purchase, and they did. It actually ended up being the number one seller across the trio of our lemonades, outselling everything two to one. That's a great representation of the innovation that we focus on and really the quality of the ingredients that we can bring at scale for our guests. So many of our teams are seeing these Qualtrics insights from finance to supply chain, of course, marketing and culinary. The guest feedback that we get from Qualtrics is pivotal to so much of what we do, from the culinary products that we create to the experiences that guests have in our shacks. It's really taking uh, what we know and feel and see in our shacks and actually enumerating that and bringing it to the team so they can get uh, better and smarter in, in their daily decision making. It helps us to move forward on projects totally aligned as a holistic team. AI is gonna play a role in helping us automate how to deliver the best offers to the right guests at the right time in a much more efficient way than we do it now. Shake Shack is now opening a, a shack somewhere in the world about every four days. We've continued to grow all over the world and don't see that stopping anytime soon. When our teams and our shacks all have the best data, that's what really creates the best guest experience.